And hello from Brussels. Brussels with the muscles, as they say. <laughs> so guys, I'm just sitting here in the greenery, just outside a tube station in Brussels, having a cigarette. On the roll-ups, as you can see. I can't afford to smoke cigarettes in, in this country. It's like seven, eight euros a packet. And we thought we had it bad. I met a couple the other day. And uh, they're from Australia. They told me they paid 25 Australian dollars for a packet of cigarettes. I mean, I think it's very close to the... Um, the US dollar but in South Africa if you had to multiply that 13 by 25 it's ridiculous it's about 280 rand a packet of cigarettes I mean for that we can buy 10 <laughs> with change so anyway um, had a great day today went to a hotel called um, a loft part of the W hotels group and shot some great videos there. Great setting, little fireplace. Um, yeah, it was great. So I shot a lot of video footage on my coming uh, cuisine show. Uh, it's it's going to be called, well, the domain will be ketogourmetchef.com. And really what I'm going to be doing is cooking recipes and making food for a ketogenic lifestyle okay that's basically where you don't rely on your metabolism to run off carbohydrates uh, you switch over to your metabolism burning your own fat for energy much cleaner um, you don't build up free radicals which as we know is the stuff that damages our cells and then cancer raises its ugly little head so yeah looking forward to it getting a little more comfortable on camera and if I can switch over here I'll just show you what the rest of the world looks like uh, no that took a picture <laughs> not sure well I'm gonna have to flip it check it this out That way. You see, so over there's the tube. You come out of the tube. And then we got like a little parkland here. There was a bit of sun here a bit earlier. Um, but very chilled, as you can see. Brussels is a very, very chilled spot. People are cool. They get on with their lives. Really no stress. So, um... Yeah, getting used to um, the Brussels way of life. Um, I need to touch base with uh, the social welfare guys this week and see as to whether they've got a, a yay or a nay. And then, yeah, slowly but surely get myself into accommodation. That's not a hotel. Hopefully um, save a little bit of money. I mean... I don't know how much more I'm going to save, maybe a hundred, 150 euros a month, which is a lot of money here, you know, it goes a long way. And that's it, guys. Hope you're having a peaceful day. And uh, best of wishes to all of you in South Africa. I hope that Zuma is not being such a clown. <laughs>